This is my studio that I work in. He called me one day, <clears throat> I've been doing some work, he called me one day and said, Harold, I've got a marvelous house for you. I said, really? He said, yes. He said, Mike and I bought the Horton Estate, mm -hmm. 163 acres. And he said, it has a beautiful house on it, but we don't want the house. He said, we want the land. So he said, come up and take a look at the house. So I did. I walked it all through the place and mm -hmm. all that. I said, it's a mausoleum. Mm -hmm. I said, who the hell could even heat this place? Mm -hmm. I said, it's ridiculous. We only had one little baby at that point. And I said, it's just, a normal, I, I can't even imagine it. I said, it's nice and all that, but I said, it's not for us. So I went home and I made a mistake. You told your wife? I told my wife. Yep. And she said, oh, she said, can we, can we see it? I made the second mistake. I said, yes, we'll go look at it. Well, she fell in love. Oh, Harold, we have to have it. It's wonderful. I love it. It's beautiful. We've got to have it. I said, the size of this thing. I said, oh, my God. So we bought it. And I'm ever glad we did. This is our living room. <laughs> and, of course, that's my wife. And, oh. and that's her there. This is... Uh, my uh, office, it's mm -hmm. you'll see clutter. Mm -hmm. you know, the bachelors are terrible. They're paintings after paintings after paintings. I went to lunch with a friend of mine, and uh, we were talking. He's, you know, religious guy. Hi, Chris, religious guy. Mm -hmm. And he said, Harold, let me, let me show you something. Mm -hmm. So he w rips out his, his Bible at lunch. Mm -hmm. And he come up with this phrase. For though I do my work with wisdom and skill, I must leave everything I have gained to people who haven't worked for it. Don't leave an inheritance. Leave a legacy that will continue to enrich the life of those who follow you. And that sold me. I said, that's what I want to do.